Question 18, make P the subject of the formula. So this is rearranging, just remember, you want to get P all on its own, and whatever you do to the left-hand side of the equals, you've got to do exactly the same thing to the right. Okay? So what you've got to do now is think about P. P has been squared, because it's bod mass, yeah, that's what happens first. P squared, then it has been multiplied by 3, and then it's had 4 taken away. Okay? So it was squared, then it was times by 3, and then 4 taken away. So what we're going to do, we're going to do uh, the opposite to P, basically. To each side, one by one. So on this side, and that side, we are going to add 4. That will get rid of that minus 4. So you end up with on the left, Y plus 4, and on the right, 3P squared. So we've got rid of the minus 4. Now we need to get rid of that 3, because P was squared, and then it was times by 3. So note what we're going to do now, we're going to divide by 3. So on this side you get Y plus 4 over 3, and on this side, because it's divided by 3, there were 3 P squareds, and now there's only 1. So we need it there. P has been squared, so how do you undo a square? Well, you square root, so square root, all of that, y plus 4 over 3, is equal to p. So it's done. Make p the subject of the formula. I'll write it again, I'll put p first. You don't really need to. But.